While you peep at others, someone peeps at you. Welcome, viewers. Well, it might sound monotonous. It's still necessary to welcome you to each video. We greet good morning every day, don't we? All right. We're still on Surah 4. Surah to the side, a surah devoted to women. And the section is five. It starts with sign 77. Still on war. Mm -hmm. Still on war. And I think obedience or cowardice. Mm -hmm. Either bravery and obedience or cowardice. Alam tara ala lezina kila lahum kila lahum kufru aidiyakum wa akimu asalawata wa atu zakawata falamma kutiba alayhim alkitalu iza iza kari iza farikan sorry iza farikum minhum Is a very commune, Yashona Yashona and Nas Wa and Nas Kahashiatin Lai Yashona and Nas Kahashiatin Lai Au Ashadan Hashiatu. <coughs> Uh, has has thou not turned thy thought to those who were told to hold back their hands from fight into brackets from fight, but establish but establish reg regular prayers and spend in regular zakat? When at length. The order for fighting was issued to them. Behold, a section of them feared men, us, dash, or even more than they should have feared God. So a section of them feared a uh, man than either us or even more than they should have feared God. Mm? Uh, uh, for Ashadan, to know more than more, more fear than God. Mm -hmm. Wakalu Rabana Lima Kata Lima Kataba Alena Alkitala Lo Lo La Har Lo La Har Tana Ila Ajilun Karib. <clears throat> uh, or even more, huh? they should have feared another. They said, Our Lord, why hast thou ordered us to fight? Would thou not grant us res respite to our natural term? Uh, to our natural term? Near enough. Near enough, uh, sorry, I, I broke it into two. It's not, it's supposed to be smooth. Uh, would thou not grant us respite to our natural them near enough? So, then it comes here. Ajilun Kariban, Ajilun Kariban, that's near enough. A term, near enough. Ajilun Kariban. Term, near enough. Uh, Kul mata un dunia kul mata un dunia kalilum wal ahiratu khairun liman liman ataka wala wala tuslam wala tuslumuna fatilan wala tuslumuna fatilan then it says say Oh. 
Uh-huh. Oh, okay. C. Uh, short is the enjoyment of this world. Hmm? Cool. Mata utunya kalilan. Kalilan here means short. Hmm? The enjoyment, mata utunya, enjoyment of this world is short. Mata utunya kalilan. Wal ahira to heron. Dima itaka. Dima itaka. Wala wala tas wala tas muna fatilan. See, short is the enjoyment of this world, and the hereafter is best for those who do right. Herun lima itaka those who do right. Wala tas muna fatilan. Never will ye be dealt with unjustly. Never will you be dealt with unjustly. In the very least, wala tuslemuna fatilan. Never will you be dealt with unjustly. In the very least, I think in the very least is an addition. Okay, we go to 78. Oh, I love this place. Hmm? It's telling us the reality. What, what does it mean? Ainama uh, Ainama Takunu Yudrikukum Ainama Takunu Takunu yudritukum al-mauta walau kuntum fil walau kuntum fil buruhi fil buruji walau kuntum fil buruji buruji mushayadatan mushayadatan wherever ye are wherever ye are Hmm? Death will find you out. Hmm. <laughs> you know, I remember when we were small boys in Tamale, <laughs> and our home was, uh, you, ha- you have to pass our home before going to the airport. That was around 1960, and an aircraft came and went down so low. We, the children, were very much afraid. You know what we did? We ran into the room <laughs> and went under the bed in the room. And the house was was not uh, roofed with zinc. It was roofed with touch, grass. Hmm? We all of us ran into the room and went under the bed until the aircraft passed before we came out. You see the man of a small world. We thought that we were safe. But supposing the aircraft were to come down there then all of us would have been bent. <laughs> I can remember it very, very, very well. <laughs> the aircraft came so low, and we never saw something like that. <laughs> you know? Okay, so death will find you out, even if you are in, ta- in towers. Anama takunu yudrukukum almota walau kuntum Filburuji, Musharatan, even if you are in towers, or in towers, built as strong, build up strong and high. Musharatan. Mm-hmm. Uh, mm-hmm. Wa in to subhum. Wa in to subhum. Hasanatin. Yakulu. Yakulu has he. Yakulu has he. Min indan. Min indan lahi. And hi. If some good befalls them, they say, This is from God. Let me read it well. Wa in to sibhum 
hasanatin yakulu haza mi in the lie better it hmm? uh uh -huh. if some good befalls them they say this is from god hmm? haza mean in the lie uh yeah, haza mean in the lie uh <clears throat> wa in to sib hum sayatan yakulu hazihi min indaka hazihi min indaka hmm? we go to the other side of it uh, pair and that we read one side of the pair we go to the other side <clears throat> but if evil but if evil they say this is from thee o oh, prophet so in other words, when they are war and uh, something good comes to them, they say, oh, this is from God. If some evil comes to them, they say, this is from you, Muhammad. So you can see, pardon me, hmm? this is from you. Hazami Indica, oh, prophet. Say, let's go. Hazami Indica, huh? Cool. Kulun me in the lie. Say, all things are from God. So we, while they think good comes from God and evil comes from Muhammad, God is telling Muhammad to tell them everything comes from God, good or bad. Hmm? So this is a lesson for all of us. If evil befalls you, you say, thank you, alhamdulillah, praise be to God. Or subhanaka, praise be to alhamdulillah, thank God. Or praise be to God. Because the evil comes from God. If good comes to you, fine. There's no dispute about that. It comes from God, certainly. Hmm? Because even if you think an evil, some, some other evil has caused it, God is supreme. God could have prevented it. God's eyes are open. He says, he says it's here for every time. But see, run, Ali, moon, seeing, all seeing, all knowing. Ali, hmm? He sees everything and he knows everything. So uh, God is telling Muhammad to tell them everything comes from God. Hmm? Hmm. All things are from God. Uh -huh. Kulla me in the lie. Uh -huh. Fala Fama Fama Lil Ha Ulai Fama Famali Ha Ulai Al Komi Lai Kuduna Yefkahuna Hadithan Let me see. So everything comes from uh -huh. But what hath come to thee, to these people that they fall, that they fail to understand a single fact? Pardon me. <clears throat> uh -huh. Let me take that. But what hath come to these people that they fail to understand a single fact? Hmm? Indeed, we fail to understand. Most of us. Even a single fact. And that's why Jesus always replies his questioners with proverbs. Hmm? He doesn't reply directly. You ask him anything, he doesn't reply. In other words, he's saying that the answer is with you. The answer is inside you. And the Quran says, Afala takilun. Don't you understand? Hmm? So uh, let me take that in Arabic again. Let's see. Hmm. Famali ha ulai ha ula il kaumi la ye kaduna yef kahuna hadi than so okay let's go to seventy-nine uh uh Wama Asabaka me has nothing famina lahi 
He's now telling the prophet directly, whatever good, oh man, whatever good happens to thee, that is to Muhammad, is from God. Hmm? Uh, for me and lie. Wama asabaka means say at him. For me, nafsika. He's telling Muhammad again. Hmm? Uh, he's, we are going to the other side of repair again, good and then bad. Hmm? But whatever evil happens to thee, to you, Muhammad, is from, is from thyself. It's from Muhammad's self. In other words, to everybody, this goes to every single individual in the world. Whatever comes, whatever good comes to you is from God. Whatever evil comes to you is from yourself. If I give out a bad presentation here, it is not from God. God doesn't have asked me to read poorly. It's from myself. I have to go back to the drawing board. Hmm? Okay. Uh huh. It's from the Pinovska. I say it in Pin. Okay, but uh, well, I sell Naka Lenasi Rasulan, and we have sent thee as a messenger uh, to people the nurse. Hmm. My my seniors didn't think didn't think it's necessary. Of course, it's not necessary to add the uh, to people. Is to D. What and we have sent D as a messenger. Oh, okay, is there to instruct mankind? The nurse, sorry, hmm? to instruct mankind. The uh, nurse Rasul and her. Wakafa bilahi shahidan. Wakafa bilahi shahidan. Uh, and enough is God for a witness. Enough is God for a witness. If nobody believes this message is from God to Muhammad, God believes it, and God alone is a witness. Mm. Uh, uh, 18. For my UT, for my, for my UT, uh, a Rasula, for cut, a ta, a Allah. I think this verse should be paid attention to. Mm? Yeah. And who obeys the messenger obeys God. Mm? Here he didn't say well, he didn't mention the name of Muhammad personally, uh, precisely. Who he who obeys the messenger obeys God. So if you be, uh, obey Muhammad, he's a messenger. You obey God. You obey Abraham, he's a messenger. You obey, you obey God. You obey Moses, he's a messenger. You obey God. You obey David, Dawood, he's a messenger. You obey God. You obey Zachariah, he's a messenger. You obey God. Well, I can't mention all of them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, whoever obeys the messenger, obeys God. The other way around, whoever disobeys the messenger, disobeys God. Mm, that shouldn't be denied. Okay. Uh, Atta'a Allah. Wama tawalla. Wama, wama tawalla. Wama arsal naka alayhim hafizan. Uh, but if they turn away, Tawalla, Pamanta Allah, but if they turn away, we have not sent thee to watch over them. The watching is left with God. Hmm? If they turn away, forget them. Muhammad, if people turn away from you, forget them. 
Don't watch over them. You can't watch over them. I can watch over them. I and my angels can watch over them. So you came along a messenger. You are only a messenger. Go and present the message. If they turn away, forget about them. Leave the rest to me. That is what God the Almighty is telling the messenger of God here. Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And all the messengers that came. Mm? All the messengers that who were reviled by their own people. Mm? Leave the rest. He has not sent you to watch over them. Mm? The watchers are there. God himself is there. And his watching angels are there. They're only there as a witness. They don't, he doesn't even need their services as such. But he doesn't do things like that. Hmm? All right. Let's go. To watch over them. Uh, 81, sign 81. Let's see. Mm-hmm. Weyukuluna. Weyukuluna ta'atun. Fa iza barazu min indaka. Bayi. Bay, uh, bayata, bayata ta ifekum, minhum, geri lazina, taku, beri lazina takulu. Uh, <clears throat> they have obedience on their lips. Hmm? They have obedience, ob, sorry, sorry, they have obedience on their lips. But when they leave the, a section of them, Meditate all night on things very different from what thou tellest them. You think Muhammad is saying this thing to his to himself? No. Muhammad did not say this thing to himself and inserted it in the and inserted. So he did not say this thing to himself and insert it in the Quran. No. Hmm? It is God who is telling him. Hmm? Let me see. Okay, I think, I think, let me take, let me see if I can take it again. Weo kuluna, twa atun, fa iza barazu, fa iza barazu mi indaka, bain, bain, baita, ta, ta, if atun mi hum, geri lazina ta kulu. Uh, beri, be, sorry, Giri Lezi Takulu. Sorry. sorry. I think I've read that already. Okay, let me repeat it. They have obedience on their lips, but when they leave thee, a section of them meditates all night on things very different. From thou, from what thou tellest them. Hmm? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> wallahu, wallahu yaktibu, wallahu yaktibu, ma you, ma you be tuna, wallahu yaktibu, ma you be tuna. But God recalls they are but God recalls their ninthly plots. Hmm? For sorry, for for what Allah From them. So keep clear of them. Fa'arud mihum. Fa'arudu. Sorry, fa'arudu anhum. Keep clear of them. Fa'arudu anhum. Wa tawakul ala Allah. And put thy trust in God. Tawakul ala Allah. So, Muhammad, keep away from them and put your trust in in God. Don't let what they do dampen your spirit. Hmm? Don't let their plots dampen your spirit. 
stay away from them and put your trust in God. This was to Muhammad. It is to you. It is to me. Wherever you are, there are people who go against you. Forget about them. Forget about them. Turn away from them. Keep away from them. And leave the rest to God. Hmm? Trust in God. And when you do that, you will see. You see how they fall one after the other. Or you see how they fail in their plots. You see how their secrets will be revealed to you. I did this before in the, my episode concerning Anajwa secret consultations. Hmm? They do the secret consultations without knowing any secret, sorry, any secret consultations they do, God is aware of them. Hmm? Okay. So put your trust in Tawakul Allah Allah. And it asks, Wakafa Billahi Wakilan. And God is enough as a disposer of affairs. God knows how to get rid of everything, whatever they do, whatever you you just be patient. Hmm? When the plot against you, be patient. You know it's a plot against you. Trust in God. And tell yourself, you have done no wrong. They're just enemies plotting against you. In fact, keep away from them, as if you haven't seen them. If you can't, just go far away from them. After some time, you watch them. You see that, no, it has all come to naught. Hmm? I said, God is not as a disposer of affairs. Wakafa Bilahi Wakilan. 82. Afala yetta. Afala yetta baruna. Al Quran. Afala yetta baruna al Quran. Do they not ponder on the Quran like we are pondering now? Yes, now we are pondering on the Quran. And God is asking, do they not ponder on the Quran? Afala afala tabaruna al Qurana. It's a question. Do they not ponder on the Quran? Walo kana mi in the gayri lahi lo. Uh, sorry, lawaka law well lawkana me in the giri lahi lawa lawa la wajad well lawaj la waja do you ra found la waja do fi he al fi well la waja do fi he if to laugh on kathi ran. Then it asks after saying asking whether they would they don't ponder on the Quran, then it comes to see. Uh, had it been from another than Allah, had the Quran been uh, from a source other than Allah, other than God, hmm? other than Jew, the French say Jew, hmm? other than God, had it been from some source other than God, they would surely have found therein much discrepancy. So if the message in the Quran were from other, other than God, they would have found in it much discrepancy. So you will see that here he even tells us to go back to the former revelations. And when you go back to the former revelations, you only have you have nothing to do but to nod your head and say, Yes, indeed. Hmm? Quran. The Quran is truth. Huh? And when there are errors in the Quran and the other revelations, you find it. There's no discrepancy. That's what this verse means. Hmm? Uh, oh, where am I? Uh, okay, let me go back a bit. A bit. Lokana mean in the lahi. Sorry. Lokana mean geri lahi. Lawajada. Lawajadu pihi ehtilafu kathiran. You would have found a need. Much discrepancy. Hmm? Uh, 
wa iza ja'ahum amrun min amrun min al amni aw aw al khaifu aw al khaifu iza aw al khaifu iza iza u bihi when there comes to them some matter touching public safety or fear they divulge it hmm? they divulge it walaw raduhu walaw raduhu ila rasul wa ila wa iza ul al amr wa wa ila ul al amr minhum la alimu la alimuhu allazina yastan yastan bi yastan bi u yastan bi una hu wa istabino sorry uh, sorry for bad reading let me take it again uh, walo walo arad araduhu ila rasul wa ila ul al amr minhum la alimu la alimuhu allazina yastan bi tu yastan bi tu na yastan bi tu na hu sorry yastan bi tu na hu minhum Mm. Sorry for bad reading. Mm. I know your ears are tired of hearing. Sorry, 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 sorry. Well, it's better to say that than not to uh, appreciate it at all. Mm. So, if they had only referred it to the messenger or to those charged with authority, Ulul Amre, those charged with authority, Ulul Amre, me whom eh, among them. Or those with uh, those charged with authority, um, authority among them, the proper investigation, the proper investigators would have known it from them. Oh God! Let me take it again. Uh, if they had only referred it to the messenger or to those charged with authority among them, the proper investigators would have known it from them direct la alimu allazina yastan bi unahu that's proper investigating among them yastan bi yastan bi u yastan bi tu nahu minhum the proper investigators among them then let's go to the next sentence wa law la fadlillahi alaykum wa law la fadlillahi alaykum wa rahmatuhu la tabuna la tabunahum la sorry la tabatum la tabatum sorry la tabatum a shaitan illa Kalilan. They won't follow Satan except a few. Let me see. So, were it not for the grace of mercy, were it not uh, the grace and mercy of God, were it not unto them, alaykum, All but a few of you would have followed Satan. Even today's where well, you see, eh? only a few don't follow Satan. I'm sorry to see. You can see what is going on. L B G T B Q. I think they will, later on they will add more words to it. <laughs> it's too long. L B G T B U. Maybe they will add W X Y Z. Eh? Eh? And they are drawing people to read. Everybody. They are drawing everybody to read. But it's the grace of God that is keeping you away from it. That is keeping me away from you from it. That is making people talk against it. Preachers, Christians talking against it. Hmm? Sorry. Men wearing uh, women's dresses. 
men marry men. If we are not for the grace of God, all of us, except a few, would have followed the route of Satan. So you see, it is there. So the grace of God, like I said before, is not only cash, mountains, aeroplanes. No, the grace of God lies in not doing evil. When you don't do evil, it's by the grace of God. My father lie. Huh? When there are women all over for men to go to. And God, being kind enough, is even creating more women than men. Such that, like somebody said it, so, so one person, one man can marry ten wives. Then we ignore them and go to women and go to men, our fellow men. Come on, what sort of feeling do you have when your, your body touches uh, the body of the opposite sex? Like somebody said, you will melt. <laughs> you will melt with excitement. Hmm? You let your body, if you're a woman, let your body, you have to, a long time, you, haven't, you don't have a man, and, you don't have, and your body touches the body of a man. You see how you will melt. Hmm? The other way around, you a man, when your body touches the body of a woman, you see how you will melt. Huh? Somebody said, he rolled my nipples, and I melted. <laughs> so you can see, he rolled my nipples, and I melted. Hmm? Then instead of rolling her nipples, you go to roll his nipples. Hmm? What a deviant. I'm sorry. We have to face the facts. Illa hmm? Kalilan. Uh, okay. Uh, sign 84. Let's see. Fakatu Fisabili Lahi. La to kalifu, uh huh. La to kalifu illa nafsika. Then fight in God's cause. Thou art responsible only for thyself. Thou art responsible only for thyself. Mm -hmm. So fight in the cause of God. The cat will feel a little lie. Well, Lad to Kalifu, Illa Nafsika. Waharid, Waharid Mout, Waharid Mormini. Thou art responsible for that, sir. And rouse the believers. I believe this one is to uh, Muhammad directly. He uh, says, Rouse the believers. Waharit mm. uh, Mominin. Let me take the English side again so that we can put things together. Then fight in God's cause. Thou art, art, thou art held responsible for thyself and rouse the believers. This is a message again to the Muhammad, I believe, he alone. He says he should fight in God's cause. Mm. And uh, that will make the believers get aroused. When they watch him fighting, they fight. So he was their commander, their model. They looked upon him. And wherever he was, there was hope. He gave them directions, and they took the directions, and they won. When they failed in taking the directions precisely as he gave them, they faced problems. <laughs> they faced problems. My friend Nati used to say, Oh, Mr. Nati, how are you? Oh, problems. It's like this year, the middle. Oh, problems. <laughs> Anything at all, problems. So in the day, he would say problems from morning to night. <laughs> Absolutely. It's, 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 it's not a, oh, no, problems. <laughs> you face problems. Hmm? Okay, let's see. Uh, And rouse the believers. Asa uh, Allahu. Uh, and Yakufa. Besa. Alazina Kafaru. It may be that God will restrain the fury 
of the believers. Hmm? So, if you are fighting in the way of God, Muhammad, and you arouse your people by doing that, and they fight along with you, uh, the fury of the believers could be lessened. What does he mean by fury? He means their fighting capacity, their fighting capability may be reduced. If you show cowardice and you are pulling back, oh no, you are encouraging them to charge onto you. But when they see you marching strongly, like David and his soldiers marched strongly towards Goliath without any fears, hmm? marching heavily and praising God, my, my brother, they will melt. <laughs> <laughs> this is the other side of melting. Not human feeling melting. Uh, but cowardice will make them melt. Huh? Okay. Uh, as I said, like, where could you go? And the Zina Kafaru, and they would be. Wallahu, Asherin. Be his son. Wallahu, Asherin. Wallahu, Asherin. Be his son. For God is the strongest in might, in might and in punishment. For God is strongest in might and in punishment. So, that is part of the punishment for the punishment for the fighters. If you, Muhammad, and your soldiers march to them, God will make them lose courage. Oh yes, it's practical. You know it. If you are fighting somebody and is not afraid of you, comes to you straight away, my brother. You will melt. You say, you ask yourself, why is this man? I think he's a weak, a cheap catch. But look at so God will. God is. God is str the strongest in might and in punishment. <laughs> okay, let's go to sign 85. Mm -hmm. Man, 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 tashfau. Man tashfau shafa atan. Hassan atan. Yekun, yekun lahu nasiban mimu. Miha. Uh, man, man yes shafa, man yes faa shafa atin hasanatan yekun lahu nasi bun min ha. Whoever intercedes in a good cause becomes a partner therein. Whoever intercedes in a good cause becomes a partner therein. Then, miha woman yashfahu shafa'atin sayi'atin yakun lahu kiflun miha. So he's going to the other one, parent. This another side of the parent in the Quran, eh? in a good cause and in an evil cause. <laughs> and whoever rec recommends and helps an evil cause shares in a burden. Mm, shares in the burden. So far at an Satan evil cause, Yakun Lahu Kiflun, a burden, mean her mm, becomes a burden uh, of it or in it. Wakan and La, Wakan and Lahu, Allah pull the she in Muki tan Wakan and Lahu, Allah pull the she in Muki tan. And God has power over all things. God has power over all things. Just trust in him. Rely on him. He has power over all things. You fail your exams. You are clever, but you go. For some reason, you fail your exams. Eh? God has power over all things. You don't know. Hmm? I remember... Uh, I did quite well in the, at my O-levels 
A levels, I went and I was so eager. Uh, I was so eager to pass that I started taking uh, drugs, hard drugs, and I couldn't sleep. I couldn't sleep a wink. Everybody was sleeping in the night. And I would just open my eyes like a cat. A week. How do you learn in that situation? Mm. But God having power in all things, I didn't, uh, even though I didn't get what I wanted, I got something, some better, uh, some alternative. And now I've abandoned everything together, I am, and I'm studying the word of God. So that was the cause of God for me. I didn't take the drug for nothing. Even if I took it for something, God knew what was forward in, uh, ahead of me. Hmm? He said, look, it's too late. What you are doing is not what I prescribed for you. You are supposed to learn the scriptures. And I believe it because people higher than me, people more qualified than me, eh, have gone back to the scriptures instead of sticking, relying on their professions. Lawyers, doctors, engineers, hmm? these astronauts, um, I understand some of them turned to God after going up and coming down. So what's the point? Huh? Because I didn't do well uh, to in my A-levels. I killed myself. Oh, no. That was not my line. God says, no. I have prepared you to do the little you can to propagate the word of God. Hmm? And that is what I'm doing now. And I'll get my reward for it in heaven. Even here, if I'm lucky, maybe I'll get some small coins from YouTube. <laughs> huh? So, and what happened to those who got qualified and did everything they, 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 they desired? They are retired now. Huh? They are retired now. And I think some of them forever. Some may go into practice until they get weak. But most of them, they've retired for work, uh, forever. They are no more at work. They no, no longer have power. I haven't, but by the grace of God, I am reading the Quran. And that alone is enough for me. When I say that, I'm not referring to me, uh, me alone. I'm referring to you. Whatever your failures are, eh, God is aware of them and has power over all things. All right, 86. Mm -hmm. What is a... What is a... Hu'i-tum? Bittahibatan. What is a hu'i-tum? Bittahibatan. Fa'ihya, fa'ihya. Fahu, uh, fahu, who? Sorry, what is a he to Tahibatan? Fayuhu, fay, fa, fahu, I'm sorry. Faha, you who will husnan, mean her, mean her. Ow, 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 Betay Hatton. Fahiyu, Fahiyu, where is the new table? But Fahiyu, Bill Husna, Ming Ha. Ow Rudu, Ow Rudu Ha. When a catcher's greeting is offered you, meet it with a greeting still more courteous. Hmm? Still more courteous. Ow Rudu ha, or at least of equal courtesy. Somebody greets you, good morning. Oh, you say, good morning, sir. Somebody says, good morning. How are you? You say, oh, problems. <laughs> no, at least get a courage to say, good morning, sir. And maybe you can then come to say, oh, I have some problems, so the morning is not very good for me. But when somebody gives you good morning, you say, oh, problems. <laughs> Mr. So Nati, how are you? <laughs> uh, okay. So meet it with a good greeting, equal an equally good greeting, or uh, something more than that, greeting more, more courteous. Hmm? 
او ردوها ان الله كان على كل شيء حسيبا God takes careful account of all things. In other words, if somebody greets you and you answer badly, God is noting it. Once he might not bother, but continue doing it to everybody all the time, anywhere, everywhere. One day he will question you. Hmm? Mr. Jacob, when you were in the world, Anybody who greeted you, you responded badly. Did you know that you were injure, injure, injuring? Uh, you were, you were, do you know that you were injuring their hearts? Do you know that that was injury on their hearts? Oh God, I didn't, I didn't remember. So, for we are, huh? He, will, he may call his angels to punish you. So that one alone can bring down your scale on the evil and the. Uh, evil side. Huh? So that one, you know, if you have good and evil, the scale on the side of the evil will go down and raise the this, uh, good side up. In other words, it goes against you. Mm -hmm. You do good, you do for yourself. You do bad, you do for yourself. <laughs> so let's see. So he takes account of everything. Let's go to 87, and uh, coincidentally, the last verse. Oh, time, time is getting against us, but let's see. Allah uh, la ilaha illa huwa. God, there is no God, there is no deity. Let me say, God, there is no deity but he. Huh? La yesh ma la yelaj ma unnakum. Ila yomil kiyamati la riba fihi. There is no God but He. Of surety, we will gather you together on the day of judgment, about which there is no doubt. La riba fihi. La naj ma unakum ila yomil kiyamati la riba fihi. There is no doubt about it. Uh, what does it is? So the last, very last part. Woman, woman, as the cum, mean and lie he had he done. Woman, as the cum, mean and lie had he done. And those words, sorry, and whose word can be truer than God's? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Woman, as the cum, saduku, that is true. Woman, as the cum, mean and lie he had he done. Whose word can be more true? than that of God. Hmm? So he's saying that, he's reminding us, there is a day of judgment. There's, there's no doubt about it. It's a surety, it's a sure, it's something that to be, is certain, it's a certainty. There is judgment. And whatever you do, is it doesn't bother him. He's giving you the ability to do what you do, good or bad. Whatever you do, there is good, or, uh, there is day of, day of judgment, and you will suffer for it, or you will be rewarded for it. Thank you very much. Illa lika iba bye. Till we meet again.